Now you got the rat oh, ring. No. That's a rat ring? Indeed, uh, it looks mad shiny though. It looks all smooth. Mine's is not like that. <laughs> this is new. Oh you my goodness. I had it for a while. My, mine's don't even have this anymore. Oh or, my goodness. I just got from all nah, nah. I broke it down. What? My rat ring is about 15 years old. Damn, so. bro. Yeah. So. I don't give away. I don't give away about three or four rat rings. But see, what I do with it, you know, my um, my former pieces that I do, though, God, you know what I'm saying? I gave them one to the God on myself, though. Yeah. Seven myself. I gave them, I gave them the larger one. Yeah, oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, this is the size for me, though. Let's see. This is Peace God. I love the red thing. You got it all polished and shit. Yeah, I, I keep it. You know, it's my <laughs> baby right now. Everywhere I go, this goes. She's one of the best who gets look. If you don't have a, if you don't have a dummy, if you don't have a Wing Chun dummy, I use scaffold. The, the Rattan ring, right? But the scaffold won't won't keep you enclosed. Mm -hmm. The Rattan ring is gonna keep your arms in, because in Wing Chun you don't flare out. Right, you know, everything is everything is elbows. Right, everything is in that ring. You're only protecting that that little cipher. So the Rattan ring is, is powerful. Also, too, if you jam them, if you That's bang right. them, it's gonna give you the strength. If you if you're banging them and stuff, you know what I mean? Indeed. Yeah. This piece, I love Indeed. the man. I love it. This, this 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 is a very valuable tool. If if, if you don't have the wing chun dummy, oh, it's essential. Yeah. If you don't have a dummy, you need that. Essential. Because mm -hmm. it helps essential. you. Because the whole point is to not have your arms flare. That's out. right. Everything gotta be. Because all wing chun just essentially is just inside fighting. Inside fighting. So. Perfect. And Tai Chi is just like you said, yeah, you know, God, yeah. it's just the, the Wing Chun is the is, is, is the small circle. You know, even even with, even with Bob Wazin, it's the same thing. But it's just and Tai Chi. When I when I, when I do the forms, God, I do everything from a Tai Chi Chuan based. Though it's, for me, it's just moving meditation. And when I go do you know my mind study, I go I, you know I renew my history while I'm doing my forms and in the Chuan because. You know, depending on depending on which form or, or, or what you're you doing, you really doing the swamp. Like with the Buddha hand, that's that's the swamp right there, though, God. Mm -hmm. I was just showing the God some rain, right? Like like the old old drills you used to do, God, right? See, look, that's that Wing Chun, but it's here though. You know, in, in, in the second form, mm -hmm. it's just yeah, it's just. No, it's, I see you, God. I see you. Yeah, definitely. You know? and, and if somebody's doing Wing Chun, and a dummy costs so much more. Um, those rings cost twenty five dollars. Twenty five. You get them for like twenty two. Depending on, depending on. Yeah, Mott Street. Yeah. Uh, what Street. you want to work on? You get the smaller one and the larger one, depending on. Yeah, yeah. Well, you would be better with the larger one though, because you know you're taller. Yeah, but I'm still. I always keep that mind state that you see me on say five. I always keep the mind state like a mere, like a mere side song, yeah. But people are like, oh, oh. When I used to buy those guys, like, oh. You know what's funny, uh, God, is that that side. deep down, that's why I love kung fu because when I do kung fu, I'm the correct height. Mm, right, yeah. yeah. Ideal, in anything ideal. I do, I'm very rarely a good height for it. But as soon as you your know? frame, though, God, your frame yeah. is not the, your frame is not typical for. Yeah, I didn't win some. You're, you're more like a, one of them like super yeah. athletes. Yeah. You know what I mean? Because ain't nobody coming with your at your height with yeah. your with your musculature and, and athleticism. Yeah. That's that's yeah. a different. But I didn't know that until I did kung fu. So I didn't know what my body type was good for until I did kung fu with Bobby. You know. Mm -hmm. So. You know. Shit. When I was in high school, I was playing basketball. So that, that tell you something. I can tell by the way. I can tell by your movements, God. You, you, you have a high vertical. You jump. I don't anymore though, because I don't really practice though, and I'm heavier than I was though. But when I used to measure in high school, it was three feet. Oh, three, impressive. Three, six inches. inches. That's yeah. impressive though. Yeah. That's impressive. That means you was like. Like if on the like the on a great day, so it was regularly 33, but my best best hit 36. So on a good day, I could clap. You know, and that's pretty good. Yeah, for guys like that's, yeah. that's like I can clap. You five three even, right? Yeah, I'm five four. Five but like four. without the yeah, without the shoes, I'm five four. That's impressive. You know, the clap. Yeah, that's impressive. It, it I've only cool. double. I've only double hand clapped once in my life, though. That's I impressive. Did I did do it. Though. To be honest, God, I'd rather but see. But this, I don't think I could do that uh, uh, again. I, don't think I, I know could. you still got the first step, though. I know you, you still explode. Yeah, because that that's useful to me. 
but jumping is not as useful. And jumping mm. high is not useful mm. in Kung Fu. Jumping for bursting is good. So I still do box jumps. Oh, I ain't do box jumps in years. Yeah, I do box yeah. jumps. But I don't do, you know, I don't do exercises like for vertical and nothing like this. What style of box do you use though? Nah, when I go outside the train, right? The railing, so it's gonna be about this high. Okay. Yeah, you know? So it's a lot of work. So like leg work is heavy for me. So like that's like 50 before I do jump rope when I'm outside. But I already do a whole bunch of stuff inside. So a regular full training day for my legs, I'm doing a thousand squats. A thousand squats, woof. No, thousand. excuse me, 500 squats in 100 sets. So it's 100 rest, 100 rest, 100 rest, right? Mm. Um, mm. And then, <laughs> yeah, and then I'm doing leg weights. So I'm doing about 300 leg, I put 20 pounds on the legs and I'm doing leg weights and then I'm doing them backwards for the hamstrings, right. weighted calf lifts, you know, all that kind of shit. Get the legs strong out there because you could do a lot of Kung Fu, but you'll get injured and you won't know why. And it's because your leg isn't strong enough. Mm -hmm. That's right. Always so that's why I do all that. Stands the more, the more, The more leg strength exercises I did done, the less I've gotten hurt. You know what I'm saying? Because I, I live a mile away from where I train. So, I, I run it because what the hell? Am I gonna walk? Why? My, why? Why not? Hmm. You know what I mean? So I run it. So when you run and stuff, you kind of feel <laughs> the injuries of your body. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know. So like when I run back home, it's the ugliest run ever. Because <laughs> I did kung fu, I did weight training, I did everything. When I'm going back home, it is an old man run to the fullest. Though I'm just like uh, everything because I put it all out there. I don't save nothing for that run. It's disgusting, guys. It's, yeah. But it feels good because it's over. Like, once I get home, I get to... If Mega did this.